Bro. You better figure out real fast. Man, go ahead. Go get a federal agent now. Oh, yeah. yeah. Go get a front Homeland wow. Security officer. Hey. We don't know. Have I entered your facility? Yes or no? A security what? officer. Dude, you're representing me like not well. Okay. Listen. <laughs> you're not representing your company well right now. Okay. Are you a security officer? No, he's not. You don't need to worry about security. Who I am. Are you, are you yeah. clear for that? He owns this business. Are you clear? Both. Why do you need ID? Right. Why are we asking? Because ID? I only because I honestly have not heard of Metro okay. State, okay. so I'm gonna Go look ahead. it up. Chief of police so knows yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll so. call him on his cell phone right now. I have his number and I will call him. Real so fast. have I done anything illegal? It's just we're gonna try to find out who, like, what this is. Oh, we're not saying you have done. Yeah. Oh. So. Well, I want to verify that. Yeah, exactly. so, you know what? I'll have my sergeant come yeah, out here. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. CP35, this guy's you want to go not happy. Can cruiser? you have a robber no, one come out here, happy. please? We're just, this has never happened before. Yeah, but we've never even heard of the... He just told you... you can what, that, that's fine. Have brochures and cards. That's what I don't do. It's that's right. fine. People, people are concerned, so that's, that's, we a, that's how we're here doing our job. It's not. It's not a huge deal, like, at all. Like, we're just trying to figure out what... Uh, or an right. What I'm trying to figure out is okay. what, what statue kind of are we? He, yeah, he was the What statue? What are we violating? But well, if you're not law one. enforcement or certified, then we have yeah, a problem. How's that? Because you can't Stop. open I'm carry and all that. I'm not That's open carry. A, what is that on your hip? Florida statute 970. that I can open carry a less lethal device at any time in uniform. Oh, is that not a gun? That is correct. It's okay. less lethal. Well, how am I supposed to know that? Yeah. Okay, it's it looks like a gun. Yeah. It's on I your hip. Well, I totally so understand. That, and I'm, so that's why I'm happy to answer your question. Okay. I'll so. get you out of the road. Well, we don't need to be like, it looks like a gun. It's kind of yeah. like if it walks like a duck, talks, quacks like a duck, it's a right. duck, right? Until right. we can determine but, that it's not a duck. But, so we're determining that it's not a duck right now. Yeah, and my body cam is on. So. It's a three prong. I have to act, advise somebody that I am, and then make that person do something under Florida statute three prong for it to be impersonated. So well, there is nothing that my I've supervisor done. is on his I way. Know. He will be more than happy to explain. And that's how it's gonna be. Yeah. Okay. And don't so. take it wrong. I'm not upset with you. I understand you have your job to do, but we haven't violated any statutes or laws. Is that is when you ran all the stuff, is that who it is? Yeah. Okay. So on, let, me just, let me just show you this picture. <laughs> yeah. Let me just show you this picture real quick. So okay. it's just this is you. Yeah, we know this should. is you, right? Yeah, okay. What does that have to do with anything? Okay. Yeah. What does that have to do with the, our business? Well, because you want a 2829 on a tag, comes back with a 27. You don't think I don't know that? Okay. That's you don't fine. Think I don't know how the state of Florida runs? Uh, the weird thing. Guess what? Here's okay. the funny thing. Before the weird thing is, is that you think you know yeah. how to yeah. I served as a cop. And then okay. I served for 12 years in the U.S. Army okay. as a major. Okay. So, well, first of all, just thank you for your service. I did something yeah. wrong so, and there was an error because okay. my brother was killed and I went home and got drunk at a bar and a girl lied about who she was. Right. That doesn't change okay. who I am. Here's so, the Instead of just running a no. tag, we pulled up. We, that's what we that's do, what we though. Did. That's we what police do. We're supposed right. to do that. So, I mean, we that's. Get that. I mean, right. We're not judging him based on something that happened in the past. We're judging him based on how he's acting right now. Well, we're judging him, not you, but him, based on the fact that if he were a law enforcement officer or security person, anytime I'm ever asked for any credential or cooperation, I just do it because yeah. I have nothing to hide. So, you're you become confrontational. Yeah. So, because because I need and to know who Metro, you well, you don't have to give it. You can walk away if you like. If you would like to leave, you are free to leave, okay? Because you're not dressed in something that looks police-ish. So. Right. But people didn't know. Are you the business owner? I am. Okay, cool. Awesome. So that's all we're like wanting said, to do is verify it. Okay. Came in as a suspicious situation. You know, we we're is, looking like, at ahead, it. You have your cell phone since you, you like to use that. You can go ahead and pull up Florida license, fictitious okay. name, pull up Metro State. I'll pop up yeah. the owner. 
that's fine. And if that's the case, then that's cool. It's like not an issue to be upset about. Like, right. you know, yeah, exactly. Here's the so, thing. We're used to the road at the end of the day. Right. Okay. Yeah, that's what I'm, I mean. Right. You're, right. But here's the thing. Here's a question. Am I free to go? At this point, so, wait till my supervisor gets right. here, and then so I'll let him decide. I'm being nice so, by standing here, yeah. and I am being nice by standing here because by law, I don't have to stand here, and I can walk away from you or get on my bike and ride away right now. So I'm being nice. I'm not trying to be confrontational, but you did kind of imply that I had nowhere to go until your sergeant got here. And quite honestly, yeah. I don't care if your three strike gets here or not. Okay. Well, it's, all we want to do is identify verify. and yeah. verify yeah. An because you're walking around right. dressed like your law enforcement. I know the stuff doesn't say, but right. you have I'm everything. My uniform yeah. My company. That's awesome. Right. And it looks legit. It yeah, looks it like does. an actual cop. Yeah. So, if you'd like, you, can you know. Up, and you can also call Orange County. That's how my guys go to funerals. This is what we do. We've been doing it for a very long time. Are you his business partner? Yes, I am. Okay. Okay. Gotcha. I was like, your guys are so confused. Okay. Yeah. That's why I was like. So how long has this company been around? I've honestly, I've never seen this We've before. Been ever. Doing this for eight years. Okay. And has this happened before? Yes. Okay. So then, it, yeah. So I we're mean, used to that. That we're used to yeah. Radio. That's why I'm being nice. But we, I'm yeah, but we have never. We have to understand. Here. Like yeah, we did. Here's the thing. I I know my Florida statutes very, very, very mm -hmm. well. So, uh, yeah. You know. So all we, yeah. I mean, they call they were like, hey, the is he impersonating? Yeah, Whatever. Sure. Take some dirt off that. Nobody. You know, they <sighs> they have to worry about ports of water and, and airports. So. <laughs> you, I don't know. What's your What's your fifty two? Okay. Yeah. It's just this guy. He is saying he's the owner of some Metro State services, special services. He said he just got doing a funeral in Bushnell, I think he said. And they stopped down here and to have lunch. We got a call from U.S. Customs because they thought this person was impersonating a police officer. Dispatch got the tag off the motorcycle that he has and it shows that he's a sex offender. So that's the problem. You can't be a sex offender and a cop. And that's what we're trying to verify right now. He said, no, we do um, transports for funerals all the time. You know, we just stopped here and have some lunch. His girlfriend's with him right now. Um, down here in Ebor, she's in school or whatever, but, you know, we asked for the IDs to verify who they are, and he's super confrontational. He's like, I, you know, I know my statutes, and he's like, I'm being nice, but I stand here, and, you know, he's quoting all this. Yeah, yeah, we, we ran the D off the tag, and that's how I knew he was coming out of the out of uh, Buffalo Wild Wings, of course, in a uniform. He's walking on here with something that looks like a gun. He's got two sets of handcuffs. You know, he's got a radio. Yeah, it's, but it says Metro State. What is the front of this thing? Metro State Vehicle Protection Unit. But, I mean, the bike's got lights on it. It's got... Um, yeah, it, it, there, there's nothing that says police on it, but right now he's in a 41 with, you know, the U.S. test and all that stuff, so, uh, but it, it's just, you know, he looks like one. Had, had I not known, I, I mean, I would have thought he was one of us, and I probably would even have given him two looks, you know, I mean, have we not gotten this call, because there's tons of security in Ebor, but, you know, th this is just the issue of verifying who he is, you know, and I said, I said, well, let me show you something. I showed him his DL picture. I said, is this you? I said, this is you. We, we see that it's you. And then he went into the whole sex offender thing because I did not even bring that up at all. But now he's causing a 41 with all these people down here. So, you know, so that, that's where we're at right now. So we're going to have some more people come back here too. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, perfect. Okay. All right, I just want to give you a little heads up, but... Okay, sounds good. Okay. They call...
call and be like, hey, is he impersonating? Whatever, sure. Talk to the fuck yeah. out. Yeah. Nobody. You know, they're, uh, they have to worry about ports of water and so hot. So. Borders and yeah. such, customs issues going on right now right yeah but i mean you can understand like we didn't just see you walking down the road and like oh my god you know blah 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 they've already run all your information apparently right. that's what they do they right. probably have more information on everybody than i do because every time i leave so, the because i see that i own a house in egypt so every time i leave the country and come back yeah they keep me for good a couple hours in customs and immigration so of course they have my why do they keep you? Because of where you because went? make sure I'm not bringing guns and bombs and because, I, because I'm actually Muslim and I own oh, a house okay. in Egypt. So oh, okay. So I'm a terrorist. So. Oh, okay. Well, so, I don't yes. know anything about that, the airport aspects of it. I mean, Every I don't know. Every time we come back, it's, it's, we have to stay in the airport for almost two, three hours. So you've had this company for eight years and this has happened before. Okay. All the time. Well, well it makes sense. Okay. So, I mean, when we get the call, it comes out like ten times more no, I dramatic yeah, than what like it is. We have a well, po- well, yeah, yeah, possibly, zero. you know. And then they like put all this information out, like the information that they get, right. and we're like, oh my god, you know. Of course, is it going to be that situation? Probably not. So, you know, but you so were upset. Come out and ask questions. Yeah, also, yeah. Yeah. Really you guys, no you don't have to be scared. You're I, I know you're just a security officer. You can step out. Thanks, you all. Hold on, let me see. You got your security officer, you're fine. What's up? Well, we're on federal property. Okay, yeah. what does that mean to me? Have I committed a crime? Security yeah. officer? Want, I want to know why you took a picture of the CBP sign with your bike. What the fuck kind of federal law is that? Well, I want to know. You better why. figure out real fast. Damn. Dep- huh? Security he, officer, who you are. He wants to go ahead. Go get a federal agent oh, now. Wait, wait, go get a fu- homeland wow. security officer hey, now. Hey, chill. Wait, we just don't know who you are. I don't give a fuck who I am. You don't have to. Have yell. I entered your facility? We don't know. Have I entered your facility? Yes or no, but security what? officer. Dude, you're representing. Like, not well, okay? Listen, you're not representing your company well right now, okay? security officer? No, he's not. You don't need to worry about who security. I am. Security. Are you, are you yeah. clear for that? He owns this business. Are you clear for that? Sir, what's your GS level? Because I know what my military level was, Sir. my classification. Okay, we don't need to go through Okay, okay. great. You are, you are, are you an officer? No, I'm not, but I work for customs. CP-35. Okay. Okay. Do you have a federal unit. badge? Please. My badge. Somewhat. Okay. Okay. Are you a federal agent? I'm a federal I'm a federal agent. Okay. Okay. Step aside. Thank you, ma'am. I'm sorry. You can step inside. Actually, you don't need to. You don't need to tell her to step inside. She can stand here, just like you can stand here. She can stand here. Okay. As soon as I enter your federal facility, then we can talk more. Sergeant gets here. I'm, um, dude, she was on the phone with him, okay? No rush. But you, listen, you don't have to yell. You you still are a business owner at the right, end of the day, that. right? I hate to be disrespected but, and for both of them to walk over here and say, are you a security guard? Well, well you're what a top a, flight security. Uh, who I said mean, that? Top flight security. You're a security officer. Don't oh. worry about it. But what I'm no, saying no, is, though, listen, just, I know it's angering, okay? I own a business, too. People piss me off all the time. But you want to represent that, okay? Right, we get that. Sure. But our, what is having, I don't know. He wants, that I don't know, because I'm not a part of the picture. Yeah. So I don't know. I can take a picture of you now and Google you. You'll probably come up as a fucking criminal oh, also. Like, you know? It's okay. Let's let the sergeant. There we go. How's that's, it going? Hey, good. How are you doing? That, that's not, I don't know who that is. I don't know. How you doing? Yeah, that's not my boss. Good. Are you major with Homeland? I'm the chief of the Okay. I don't know. Your security officers are very confused about their job and their jurisdiction, which is this this line here. You guys. Yeah, yeah. Okay, and so they they called the Tampa Police Department, who made a huge issue because my motorcycle's here, Tampa PD's here, trying to figure out what's going on, causing a huge issue because they forgot that this jurisdictional line right here, this tile line, is their line. So 
from here, Point is Tampa PD. Not, so not, you, not, not an issue. Right. Thank, Thank you, Thank you so you. much, Major. I really, truly appreciate yeah, it. I apologize for that. I apologize for everything going on. Yeah, our supervisor's coming still. But you're, yeah. yeah, he wanted to talk to our supervisor. I don't know how you got called, but. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Thank you. Yeah, you're fine. Oh, you're good. Good talk. Literally, we drive around, I kid you not, especially now that we have these body cams, people take pictures of me, all this, all the time. I smile, like I'm not even joking, I smile, it's just, it is what it is, it's part of the job, so. so that I had one guy on a call, I kid you not, these are just employees, I don't understand. I don't have a problem. Dude, there's a show now, but there's a show. Yeah. Everybody wants to see it, like, this, but it's a show now. Your fucking job is something I was wrong. Once the sergeant shows up, we'll have to clear that up so we can go back in. Thank you, Major. Sorry about the inconvenience. pretty much like what the hell just yeah. happened out here like what was this about he's like i was eating my lunch and <laughs> yeah. i got interrupted <laughs> watching judge judy <laughs> oh my god that's it's interesting that it turned into Dude, it, it got up there because you got pissed. That's what happened. Was I can tell you if like you were, it would have been a lot better. But but I, I can't work with this. You know. Okay. But listen, I get pissed all the time too. I can't act that type of way. I can't. You know. And then this is where I am now because because a girl lied to me and the state felt that they would drop her. Because guess what? The funny thing is, is they arrested her for giving a fake ID to a police officer. But they dropped her charges so they could. Hey. Court. So I like you. Like. I just, I'm too old for any BS at this point. I'm tired, it's hot, it's summer. Let's just cut to the chase of everything, you know? Like, I'm not judging you on your past, but yes, we want to figure out what's going on. And we understand that. So. How are you? Good, how are you? Good. How are you doing? So this is our boss. So what had happened was, we get a call from Customs saying that the, this gentleman is dressed like an officer and he's not an officer. They had concerns that he was impersonating an officer, maybe us or whatever, or made something up, we don't know. These people here own this company, which is Metro State. I guess it's a legitimate company per Google. Um, I don't know. Per Sunday. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. It's so, okay, yeah. So anyways, um, and then uh, what? Ha you are a hothead for sure. Yeah. Because he got pissed with them over here and no, was, you know. Their jurisdiction ends right here. This is this is their this is their jurisdiction. Right here what? is TPD. They, they got pissed because he parked there and took a picture. Like, that he wasn't impersonating the cops. Okay, we already, you guys we already found that out. Wow, huh? mm -hmm. yeah. I said we already found that right. out. Yeah, they told us you were over there. That's how we knew you were there. I mean, we didn't just... We met you at the door. Okay. And then we were waiting on the supervisor, and then... Oh. Oh, where? Okay. Okay. Um, I'm not sure. I just know when I ran the tag and then I ran his, uh, like they attached the, the 20 and 20, 29 to the thing, it showed that he was a sex offender. So, and he said it himself. He's, he's like, I'm, you know, based on my past or whatever, I'm thinking a cop can't be a sex offender. That's, that's how we're at all this stuff. But, right. It, it, it looks like one, but no, it's not. It, it has like something, some kind of, almost like the SIM guns that we use. But I don't know, projectile? Right. Right, right, right. We were just trying to verify, you know, all the stuff before we let him go. And then the U.S. Customs people came out here. The Department of Homeland Security people came out here. And it was this big 41, yeah, so. No, we're here. Corporal just pulled up. He's talking to him, so. That's what we're Okay. Okay, perfect. All right, thank you. Sarge is on 7, he said. Yeah. Hot. And then 
these people came out. So I think you wanted to talk to our sergeant or something, yeah. right? Well, as long as we're free to go, we're good to go. Okay. Yeah, so you said wait like here. You said no, wait here. No, he's so thought. Okay. Yeah, he okay. said she he said wanted to talk, and I said, well, if you want to wait. Okay. And then, oh, was he here? No, that's not him either. He drives a white from it. Um, so, yeah, I mean, if you have any complaints, so that's who you would make it to about us. No and then any complaints that you have they, on them, I don't know. Did they do anything to you? Did they no, get their hands on you? No, no, no. Okay, no. Yeah, but we, we identified, I guess, dispatch says that this is a company. It's a legit company. They were just in oh, I hope so. I mean, they yeah. tripped out what? Yeah. All of our vehicles are that way. In fact, your one star bald headed chief talked to me not too long ago. I don't even know who that is. Which one is that? Brian. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I would call Brian a, a one-star bald-headed chief. Wow. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, so we, we, we've had a few nice talks. Okay. But yeah. So we're all good now, right? Yes, we sir. are. Okay. You got more cool shit than I I know. Maybe we ought to retire and come work for this company. Like, hey, it's fine. So what do you guys do? I'm just curious. Well, she's in the process of becoming, getting a job on life. So I'm on break. Okay. So you, you track down the guys that jump on? That too. We do high risk no, kills. Uh, wow. We, uh, we, we uh, uh, escorted a car the video. We actually wow. escorted a truck before he became an elect. It must be an elect. Uh, right. Except for Florida, Orlando, Orange County, OBD cannot do escorts anymore. So we do it. So I have 20 uh, BMW motors. Wow. So it's your company. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's cool. That's expensive. Yeah. I got 20 of them. And we have about 12 cars. From Chargers to Crown Vicks to Tahoe. Did you guys order? Yeah, yeah, we're, okay. yeah, they're leaving, okay. I guess. So, so she said that this is her last ask yeah, the car. So I was going to say, okay, well, now this because no, you guys are here opinion. but no we were the only reason why is because we did a military funeral from downtown Orlando yeah. we brought the he was a major in the army yeah. and he passed away and we took him to Bushnell okay. and she was here for school on lunch and I was like well it's only a 30 minute ride so I came here from Bushnell was and she started blackmailing me for money when I stopped paying her she all of a sudden went to the sheriff's office and started making false complaints do me a favor while you're doing an investigation mm -hmm. look her up because she keeps calling DCF mm -hmm. every other month saying that I'm sleeping with Jessica's children. Jessica is? My ex-associate. Ex okay, this the girl you were with in Tampa? Yes, in Tampa? correct. Okay. And all this, yeah, all this, okay. So, like I told so, the so, past driving on the street, I would not have even looked twice. I would, I would have assumed. Yeah, I would have assumed. Driving, but yeah. We get calls and we have to investigate. Or it's okay. And yeah. Figure out what the deal is, and you know, information is provided, Watch and that's out. how we got. And his, the and his, and in the past stuff, stuff so. we don't really even make determinations about. You know, it's. It wasn't that. It was the way she. I pulled you up. Yeah. We're trying to ID I who you up. are. We get that. Yeah, we're good. So. And don't get so mad. God. I just, we hate when people try to, top flight security try to overstep their boundaries. Like, but we know our status. If we I overstepped don't our boundaries, yeah. we'd be tempted to infer, impersonate him. Right. So, but because he's a federal employee, which although he's a security officer, he's a federal security officer. His jurisdiction ends here. It's like my rules. So what happens, I'm not even joking right now, what happens if you're walking down the street and like somebody comes running up to you, you know, there's an emergency or whatever? Well, we would help. Do you guys? You better believe I would. Help. We would help. That's still, that you have to. Yeah. That's I, I didn't human serve, nature. I didn't serve 14 years in Iraq and Afghanistan. I turned around and run away. That's why my business exists the way it was. What department did you work at? You said you were a police? I was an Oviedo police officer. Oh, Orlando. Orlando. Wow. Yeah, Oviedo. Okay. Then I did the Army. I, I was young and dumb, and I wanted action, so I joined the Army, was a Ranger, and then I went to SF, and then my parachute didn't work right. My back got hurt. My brother got killed. And uh, I drank, and life changed. It could happen to any one of us, though, honestly. <laughs> that story yeah, could business. be any one of us. So, yeah. at the end right. of the day. So. Well, okay. well, very nice to meet you both. <laughs> Thank you for your time. Uh, Sorry to bug you. Good luck. Yeah. This is what I do. Call us if you guys ever need a, your family member. Sorry to say. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Escorting all day. Uh, all right, y'all. Right, Bye. Sorry Ladies about again, I'm yeah, sorry. sorry. It's not that I was so abrupt. I was just. Yeah, be nice. Come Very firm. We don't want to be out here in the heat. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's like, we'd rather be, we were typing reports, and this came in like it was like the end of the world. We're yeah. like, what? <laughs>
what in the heck? You know, so, you know, but now it's straight out. So you'll have a good day. Good luck with your uh, company and all that. Be careful, too. Be careful. Like, there's some crazy. I'm getting more defense classes and everything. Yeah. 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 Just sometimes it's not always worth it, right? Remember that. Yeah, that's So, like, you're first, okay? Don't don't let the money, you know. Right, yeah, my safety first. Yes. Okay. All right. See ya. Thank you.